welcome back friends to another video today's video is going to be a day in the life vlog a real day in the life of a mom of two and here i'm just going to pretty much just show you how i make my coffee in this case my matcha before we head out hiking and if you are new here welcome please consider subscribing I would love to have you. I upload weekly videos, some grocery hauls from Costco, Trader Joe's, and Whole Foods, as well as day in the life videos. No sé, no toques, deja ahí. Oh, okay. Mommy, watch out! This is this one! Whoa! Bobby! It's like, say, it says, buzz, buzz, buzz! It says, buzz. That's your name, it's been the site, please. Okay, how do you spell it? Write it down. Well, it's, it's not the low. Here, let me I spell it for you. You tell me what to write. How do you spell it? I spell it in the world like you know. Oh, hey, Mr. Beetle. Here you're going to see us actually have breakfast on this hiking trail. And the kids really enjoy doing this, so that's why we do it. I usually just pack either oatmeal. In this case, it was overnight oats. And I pack them in these tubs that I reuse from our feta cheese just in case we ever needed to just toss them out if we were in a hurry then we can just go ahead and do that our hike is over now we have Sophia here getting buckled Lucas where are you there he is Lucas say hi hi <laughs> and we are getting ready to go home we're going to i'll probably shower my husband will shower the kids will just get refreshed and then lucas is going to school after school i will come home put sophia down for bed and then i'll take a breather for about an hour and then we have to head back out to pick up lucas but that's pretty much it we already had breakfast as you guys saw here on the mountains like we like to call it but yeah we'll see you guys a little bit later I picked up my Maru coffee it's the spiced iced coffee it's so good but it's super sweet and I always forget I don't come here as often because there's usually like a 20 30 people lying so the um, I always forget that it's sweet. I always get this, but I always forget that it's too sweet and I always forget to tell them light syrup. I usually take my coffee unsweetened. This is immediately after we got home from our hike. I was having second breakfast because I actually, if you didn't know, I have some injuries on my neck and my back. So it's very difficult for me to do any type of exercise and when I stand too much, sit for too long, whatever it may be, my back is literally on fire. So I had to have second breakfast to have some pills here. Mom lied. We are going Mom, to Nina. share. Nina. Oh yeah, Nina's calling. We'll call her right back. Lucas and I are going to share this while he's working on his other snack here. Say hi, friends. Hi, friends. <laughs> After picking up Lucas from school, we actually made our way to our local bakery to pick up sourdough bread, walnut bread, and then health bread. These are just the names that they give it, but their bread is so delicious. I want, I want this one for me. Okay. Sofia, ¿cuál vas a agarrar tú? Um, the pink one right over there. Okay. We just picked up our bread. So this is our walnut 
bread, sourdough, and the health bread. Crazy plant lady here just casually watering her variegated string of pearls. Seriously though, this is the story of my life. There isn't a day that goes by that I'm not watering a plant or tending to a plant. Hashtag plant lady. A failed attempt here to tidy up the kitchen a little, but, oh, hey, Harlow. shark is way too heavy to be carried yes yes <laughs> so now that the kids are fresh and bathed it is time for me to get dinner going so I'm going to make bean and cheese taquitos for the kids or quesadillas so here you see that um, I, I keep it really simple really if you follow me over on Instagram then you know that I try to be really mindful of the things that I'm putting in my kids body especially when it comes down to processed foods but at the same time I am um, very very simple when I cook so here you see me refrying beans without any oil the beans are beans that we boiled ourselves and the beans or any legume for that matter does need to be organic this is just regular uh, Monterey Jack cheese if I'm not mistaken and I am shredding it myself because if you buy already shredded cheese it has a bunch of chemicals and anti-caking agents or yeah anti-caking chemicals I don't recommend it these tortillas are very good quality tortillas they're siete brand and they are made out of almond flour so like I said they have a ton of protein they're just really good quality so as simple as this meal might be it is still extremely nutrient dense which is what's important to me This is Lucas's plate. He's very good about eating his fruit. This is Sophia's. She prefers pistachios. And this is my plate here. Very simple, just with a little side of salsa. Okay, so the kitchen doesn't look perfect yet but at least the stove is clean the dishes are washed <laughs> and my little helpers here are going to help me make what are you going to make granola okay Oh, you want to record. Okay, well, we're going to make granola right now. And we're going to make granola. Bye. 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 Mommy, we are bye. toasting our oats, all of our nuts, with a little bit of salt, a little bit of cinnamon, and then now, oh, and coconut oil, of course, for roasting. Now we are going to add maple syrup and date syrup 
and that's pretty much it it's really really a simple recipe i'm going to be making a reel over on my instagram Mommy, account me so one yes one second one second so i'll be making it uh, as an instagram reel so that you guys can get the recipe so just look out for that if you're not following me already be sure to do so this granola is seriously super easy and just the best but we are at the end of this video if you enjoyed this day in the life of a mom please give this video a big thumbs up thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on the next one bye